Welcome to the rocket profile of the Falcon 1, the first privately developed surface-to-orbit launcher. The Falcon 1 only utilized two engines. The first stage had a single Merlin 1A engine on the first two launches, and a Merlin 1C on the final three launches. Two of the launches with the Merlin 1C made it to orbit, while the other three launches failed. The Merlin 1C had 480 kN of vacuum thrust and a vacuum specific impulse of 304.8 seconds. It burned kerosene and oxygen for 2 minutes and 49 seconds. The first launch of the Falcon 1 had a fuel line leak which caused the loss of vehicle 33 seconds into launch. On the second launch, the second stage experienced oscillations that eventually led to premature engine shutdown so that the test payload failed to make it to orbit. With the first Merlin 1C launch, the third launch overall, this first stage had residual thrust on the coupling and collided with the second stage. As the story goes, SpaceX had one more launch attempt left in it before it would be forced to shut down, and that fourth launch turned out to be success. With the subsequent launch also a success, the Falcon 1 was retired in favor of the much larger Falcon 9. The second stage engine, the Kestrel, uses kerosene and oxygen to provide 31 kilonewtons of thrust for 6 minutes and 18 seconds, with a specific impulse of 317 seconds. The Kestrel has not been used in later SpaceX designs, while the Merlin 1C was developed into the Merlin 1D, which provides twice the thrust as the 1C with better efficiency. With its very simple two-engine kerosene and oxygen design, the Merlin 1 is reminiscent of a smaller Zenit 2. This made it an affordable initial foray into the space launch market. Unfortunately, with its 180 kg demonstrated capacity to orbit and potential to carry only around 600 kg, the market for its services was small, even if its reliability could have been improved. SpaceX had proposed to develop a Falcon 1E and improved the design, which would have a better Merlin 1C and a Kestrel 2, and that would have been able to lift one ton into orbit, but abandoned those proposals. And so, the part this rocket played was merely as an essential stepping stone to the Falcon 9. And on that note, thank you for watching this rocket profile of SpaceX's Falcon 1.